Good morning, Porcupine Smith. You know, I've been following this thing going on in Ferguson a little bit, you know, with the, the protests and whatnot against the police, the conflict between the police. And, I mean, the world has literally just got insane. They're doing yet a third autopsy on the kid. You know, I'm no expert on, on you know, forensic medicine. But I'd say, you know, he died of getting shot six times, two times to the head. I'm just guessing maybe that's, maybe that's why, he, you know, I mean, it's just absurd. And they're going to do like yet another autopsy, the federal government and all this crap. Because, you know, I mean, the, the, the bastard shot the poor kid, you know. He wasn't armed. The police are wrong. They can't admit it. So they're doing all these autopsies to try to justify, I don't know what they think they're going to tell, you know. <laughs> they're not going to determine anything in terms of, 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 you know, blame or exoneration by autopsies. I just think it's absolutely insane. I think the police officer should be charged with um, manslaughter. You know, manslaughter. He killed the kid. Um, he didn't wake up that morning and go out, you know, planning to kill someone. So it's not premeditated murder, but it's still uh, wrongful death, and uh, he should be discharged from the police department and and charged with the some crime apropos for taking the kid's life. The kid was unarmed. No reason for that. It's horrible, and I'm just sick of the insanity, these, these autopsies and all this uh, posturing and manipulating and decontextualizing the matter. Um, I mean, you know, he got shot in the head. You know, they shot him six times. It's what for the autopsy. Anyway, that's my rant for this morning. Have a good day.